you got little ocean view house. Is, there is a view there, but the view up here is better. So I got the stairs. Oh my God, Sam, I need to put this aircon on. It's so hot. Can you sort out that aircon? Oh my God, I'm gonna die. We've got like two little bathrooms, nice big bed, Sam's bed. <laughs> no, it's not funny. And then we've got ocean view and a really nice pool. Just beautiful. It's just like three little villas here. And we've got the best one. I actually put makeup, I can't even remember the last time, well it would have been Kuala Lumpur or something um, and my hair looks a, a tad on the ridiculous side but you know, I'm on holiday, that's the rule It's like cocoa powder He's being a worse than that, I'm just going to eat it I all. breathe in as I'm about to swallow. Yeah, but... I have it, but I eat really quickly. In <laughs> so when you breathe in with this, you just get cocoa powder right on the back of your Right up in there. Right up in there. Cause they can never stop you. No way they're gonna top you. You've got to make it all or nothing now. So take it to the limit. I know that you can. Twenty minutes away from the chocolate hills from munching um but it's just started to rain really bad so we pulled over into a little shelter to keep the bike dry um and we're waiting out the rain you've got nothing to lose and everything to prove when you are on your own and in the danger zone looks like they won't play nice we'll make them all think twice yeah you're reckless baby I'm too scared since we got injured on the bike with this. Um, I'm just really scared of the like gravity path. So I'm making Sam do this bit on his own. <laughs> Don't graze your knees. It didn't feel very well, so I've got a water. And Sam's got a chicken pineapple thing. So it's breakfast for one today because Lottie's not feeling very well. This has to be probably the worst um, sort of bug that we've had this whole four months actually she's been really sick overnight she's been um, back and forth from the toilet pretty much every hour um, so we were going to keep the bike for another day and have a look around the island but obviously we've now got a new priority which is just needs to try and get better because we're moving on tomorrow so we're just gonna have a rest day today Boracay it's really rainy so I haven't really filmed anything of what the hotel looks like um, it's called Seven Stones Boracay um, just because everything looks disgusting right now but it is really nice and um, we've got this lovely room this bed is massive actually probably doesn't look that big and then the bathroom's really big as well I love all the mirrors we've got another one here but they are really dirty so I'm going to be Miss Snazzy Pants and ask them to clean it because it's just not acceptable but we've got loads of space and it's amazing and they gave us a necklace <laughs> do you like yours? I mean I wanted to clear up but I didn't choose to wear this <laughs> <laughs> and um, the welcome drinks are really nice as well which is good because usually the tears like poo um, so yeah I'm happy are you happy? yeah 
excuse my hair it's super disheveled from the rain but yeah sorry for being totally MIA I think Sam did some vlogging yesterday um I had food poisoning or a bad reaction to something I ate at lunch the day before day before yesterday um I've never vomited so much in my life like I vomited like 10 times to the point where it was like oh I probably shouldn't describe it it was just disgusting this chocolate since New Zealand and we love this we love it <laughs> and I've got some yakult to see if this helps my tummy you know goes well with the chocolate and then finally finding applicator tampons in Asia touch every day at like sunset like late afternoon um the hotel staff bring around like baked goods yesterday we had flapjacks and today it's cookies i can't sleep so i'm trying to make sam get up so we can go to breakfast and then go to the gym <laughs> he went to the gym yesterday but i was still feeling a bit meh um but now i want to go lift some weights i feel so teeny tiny i need to go lift my muscles are so small. Look at my legs. Is it too late if I come now? Could you stay up to figure this out some way? If I stay here, would you come back? If I stay cool, would you be mad? Would you want me if I want you that way? Isn't it strange every time? Look at your name, I'm suddenly high. I'm sweaty. Oh, that's the sweatiest I've been growing. We got so sweaty, but look at this beautiful setting. It's another gorgeous day. It's on like a farm, this gym. It is so nice. But now we're gonna go back and sunbathe, aren't we? Yeah, and helmet dive. It's freezing too. <laughs> it didn't bring me my bacon. <laughs> I want my bacon. Bacon. <laughs> bacon is good for me. So we are back from the gym. I might have put a few clips in because Sam filmed some, filmed some stuff on his phone. Just two days left. Well, we've got the rest of today and then all day tomorrow and then we're flying home on Tuesday mm -hmm. to get home in England on Wednesday morning. So we're gonna go stick up the sun. Sam's making me do like this helmet diving thing which I really don't want to do but I think I'm gonna have to do it. Sacrifice. And um, yeah just sunbathing, visiting a few different beaches and enjoying the sun. Go then. Just sit on it. You need to shuffle up. I never felt a room so still. See the future coming. Hope it isn't real. 
I learned to fake a smile That's the time I'm out I don't wanna wait Oh, I don't wanna mistake Two thousand miles in an ocean away And I see the sunrise I'm quite excited actually, it'll be fun, but I'm just scared that I won't be able to breathe and all the water will come in. But apparently it's like Pirates of the Caribbean when they're in the boat and their heads are dry and they can breathe. Fingers crossed. Just like the other day, bitch, you're right as I fall asleep. Tell myself it's alright. Oh, 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 as the tears roll by. Look at the size of the sandwich. <laughs> We've got another turn down service. This is so cool. I wasn't this expecting great. this. Every night they come around. I can't get into it. Help. This doesn't look as good today. Oh, sad face. <laughs> oh my god, it's coffee cake. It's coffee cake. Beaches as busy as Bali. May or may not be talking about our next big trip, which is a secret. I don't know where it is. So it's our last day of traveling. Well, our last full day in the Philippines. Um, I've just woken up and I was just admiring the mess on the floor. <laughs> We've got to pack our bags today, obviously, one last time. Um, but it's good because we're not getting up like anti-socially early in the morning. So we can have breakfast at the hotel as normal and then the flight and then we get home on Wednesday morning. And Sam won't get up because he's moaning he's bloated. What a girl. I'm just really sad about leaving. I'm kind of in two minds. I'm really excited to get back to certain things and get back to it, even though we're going straight away to Sicily again. <laughs> but I'm like excited to see my family and stuff. Um, but I am feeling super anxious and just it's just too surreal. Like that this trip has just been so long. Like Australia feels so long ago. I was just looking at some pictures and I was really pale. <laughs> and um just like I don't know, I just feel like a different person. The trip's been incredible and it just feels really surreal. So I think I just feel a bit like oh about going home. Um but I'm excited as well. So mixed feelings and let's go enjoy the last day in the Philippines. <laughs>
packing the bag for the last time. I just haven't cared here. Usually I'm a bit more organized, but here I'm like, fuck it, we're going home soon. I'm gonna chuck everything in the wash. <laughs> so I just need to fit it all in the packing cubes, which are amazing, by the way. You have to get these packing cubes if you're coming away and using like a rucksack like this. We are just going for our last dinner in the Philippines. Um, We've just been eating at a hotel like all the time because it's really, really good. I'm sure I probably would have put the hotel details already. Um, but we really like the food here. So we're just gonna go for dinner and reminisce about the last four months um, and then finish packing. I've done a pretty good job. Um, it's all down here, putting my leggings out and stuff for the plane. So we are just getting ready to start our 20 29 hours of traveling. It's like 8 a.m. on Tuesday morning and we're arriving home. Wednesday in England at 7 a.m. Obviously there's like a seven hour time difference. The Philippines has been amazing. I can't remember how much I've said it in other videos because I haven't edited anything yet. I just need to <laughs> edit everything when I get home. Um, but Boracay, where we've just been now, is amazing for white sand beaches, but it is kind of like a party island. Um, not that we really saw much of that, but it's a lot more touristy, especially with a lot of like Chinese, Asian tourists. Um, so it's way more busy than other places we experienced in the Philippines and our hotel is like slightly bigger than other ones we stayed in so um, different experience but still really good it was really nice just to relax we didn't do a lot um, the helmet diving was really fun <laughs> um, but yeah I would recommend other parts of the Philippines more which I would have showed you in all the other videos but the Philippines as a whole has been amazing we felt like really safe the whole time which is something that a lot of people I think are scared of and something that we were scared of I was scared of because um, of like all the terrorism going on and they put, I can't even remember if I said this, I probably did, but they put the, um, they put Cebu where we went to Oslo for the whale sharks in orange on the travel website, which is like only go if for essential travel. Um, but yeah, we've found that everyone's been super friendly. We've had no major incidents. Everything's been fine. Touch wood. Um, but yeah, the people are just so, so friendly. Like say hi just for the sake of being friendly and uh, we just really really loved it here. I definitely think we saved the best till last apart from New Zealand Which was also great. We are gonna go have our last breakfast in the hotel and then we are off to the airport um, We're flying to Manila, which is the main airport in Philippines And then we're flying to Bangkok and then we've got a transfer flight to London Heathrow Thank you for watching our adventures. Thank you for watching the Philippines and um, if you're going feel free to message me and I will answer any questions but hopefully I put text on the screen to like show where we stayed and ha hopefully how we traveled and stuff. Um, but yes, thank you so much for watching and Sam say bye. Bye. And, <laughs> and we will bye. see you soon. It's a video. Oh, it's a, it's a video.